Good morning, you guys. Uh, welcome back here again to my uh, closet project. So where we are right now is um, where it started. Already started assemble the uh, the cabinets. So the plan here is, as you can see, there's like an axis up there, right? So we won't be able to. We won't be able to. Shit. We won't be able to put the uh, full cabinet in the height. So what, what we did, we ordered the shorter, the shorter one instead of the 94 one because the other one is 94. And then, and then for this height, we're still having a problem. So the plan here right now is like we have to shave it off like that. We have to cut it down. Just cut the top, the top one only. It's just like that. And it's still gonna be work. I, I could still put the, uh, the rod here for the hanger. Right. So the first one is done. So now I'm doing the other one. So what happened is we're doing a little bit custom here on the bottom one. That's all. slightly angled angle it out like this not too much because you don't wanna you don't want the nails sticks up there right instead of just straight down like that it's okay too but I always like to do angle a little bit like this reason why I like to do that because just in case right you missed it I'd rather to I'd rather to have that nail stick out here than inside because what's in inside you can't fix it all right now right in that corner I have the other video how, how I assembly the cabinet on that side, you will see a gap. It's about it's about an eighth. So make sure don't don't make it like this, right? So whatever you have here, so whatever you have there. Make sure you line that one up all the way down. Wait, so you gotta open this up like that. Just like the one up there. Right. 
So now it's time to mount the cabinet. So right now we're just gonna cut the fillers and we'll put it on. All right, well, one filler is already done. Now we're gonna do the other side. It's time to dress up. We're all good. So that's the axis. That's what we did. All right. Alright, so this is how it looks right now after we uh, install all the uh, the doors and that tracks. So what we did here is we we customize the door. Then not actually actually that height. So I have to shave it down to in in order to fit it right. Right, the door was like uh, eighty. Mm, was that? Uh, the door was like 90 and I shrink it down to 84 All right so it turned out nice All right so this is how it looks and now the other problem was 
the the, the tracks there's uh, there was like a, a guide that's supposed to be mounting on the on the floor but uh, it doesn't work so I, I just did some cosmetics here I used one of the uh, quarter rounds and I cut them to pieces and because I have no choice right so in order to puncture it and I have to put something those two back in front to guide it I know it's it's kind of like on the way but uh, that's the only way to do it all right guys all right so thanks again for watching so this is the complete um, finish of the uh, IKEA with the barn door So you want to see how it function? It slides okay.